UK's new travel requirements, coming soon. According to the latest mainstream news updates, Sajid Javid, UK's health secretary mentioned that, he wants to end the PCR tests requirements for travel in the UK. In a statement, Sajid Javid further said, England vaccine passport plans will also be ditched. Let's begin the video and tell you more about the latest updates, which states that the requirement for PCR tests for double vaccinated holidaymakers will be terminated as soon as possible. Sajid Javid mentioned that he desires to dispose the requirement of PCR tests for travel as soon as I possibly can. The health secretary stated he was mindful of how expensive it is for families holidaying out of the UK and the rule should not be in place for a second longer than is utterly obligatory. Mr Javid further mentioned that he asked officials to remove the rule at the moment we can. On Sunday, he said that I'm not going to make that assessment immediately, but I have already requested the officials that, the moment we can, let us chuck out these kinds of invasions. The amount of the fee that generates for families, particularly families just trying to go out and holiday, you understand we should not be keeping anything like that in position for a second longer than is utterly essential. It arrives during reports, expensive PCR COVID tests may be scrapped for fully vaccinated holidaymakers on their arrival back to the UK. Please keep in mind that NHS free lateral flow tests could substitute the pricey PCR test, which is presently obligated on the second day after arrival and can cost more than £100. It has been reported that the UK Prime Minister Boris Johnson, Chancellor Rishi Sunak, Mr Javid, and Cabinet Office Minister Michael Gove will apparently be in discussions over the plans this week. Presently, passengers coming back from green list countries or amber list countries, if they are fully vaccinated need to take PCR tests on or before day two after they come back to the UK. Previous month, PCR tests came under fire as travelers encountered high costs and poor service from many of the 400 authorized test firms mentioned on the government's official website. It was discovered that tests cost about £75 generally, but prices can touch hundreds. This is the end of today's video update. If you found this video update useful, then please comment below and share this video with your friends and family on Facebook, WhatsApp, and Twitter. Thanks for watching.